day and peace be with you everyone. A convocation is conducted every quarter to recognize students who have excelled academically and have given their best in their studies. Students with outstanding character are also acknowledged through this program. It is also through this convocation that parents and guardians are honored for their unwavering support and care for their children as they are being recognized as some of the best in their level. Our dear parents, guests, teachers, administrators, Polinians, welcome to St. Paul College of Makati's virtual convocation for the first quarter of school year 2022-2023. As we begin our program, let us dispose ourselves for the opening prayer to be led by Vangelin May Sinina, Grade 7 Awardee, followed by the singing of the Philippine National Anthem. Let us be aware of Christ's presence in our hearts and adore His holy name. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Heavenly Father, the source of all knowledge and wisdom, we thank you for this opportunity to recognize our achievements, which symbolizes all of the hardships and struggles that we overcame in the first quarter, despite the pandemic. We thank you for our formators, sisters, staff, and teachers here in St. Paul College of Makati for providing us a space to develop the treasured gifts that you have bestowed upon us, for lavishing us with their love and care and for teaching us what it truly means to be a Christ-centered Polinian. We thank you for our friends and family for being supportive and for making the most stressful moments more bearable. Lord God, fill our minds with wisdom to help us distinguish between right and wrong and fill our hearts with love to give us confidence and courage to face the new challenges that await us in the future to be a role model for others, and to help the least, the lost, and the last. We ask through Jesus Christ, our Lord, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, one God, now and forever. Amen. Mary, our mother and model, pray for us. St. Paul, our patron, pray for us. Father Louis Chabay and the First Sisters intercede for us. May the love of Christ impel us, now and forever. Amen. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Mga kababayan, ang pambansang awit ng Pilipinas. Today, we honor students who have shown excellence in academics and conduct. This school year, we celebrate our 80th founding anniversary. Hence the theme, Journeying Together in Bringing Heart and Soul to Polinian Education. To formally welcome us to this program, we would like to call on Mr. RJ Porcincula, Advisor of Grade 7, St. Aloysius. Sister Myrna B. Castante, SPC. Our Directors Principal. Sisters, Law Administrators, Faculty, Staff, 
And to our parents, guardians, and students, good day and peace be with you. I am honored to welcome you all to our first quarter convocation for the school year 2022-2023. First and foremost, I would like to commend everyone for a job well done. Despite all of the challenges brought to us by the pandemic, we are here to celebrate the fruit of hard work of the parents and efforts of the students. Is it true that among the events held in this school, this is one of the most important occasions because this is the day that we appreciate all the time and hard work of the students that excel in different subjects. It also shows the good disciplines and behaviors that makes them outstanding and role models for the first quarter of our school year. Each convocation day is a time we collect all the seeds that we have planted since the start of the school year. This is the day that we get the rewards of overcoming the challenges and hardship through dedication, perseverance, and faith. Today also marks how one exhibits the qualities of our patron, St. Paul, discipline, excellence, and tranquil daring to become a mindful, self-directed learner and a role model. We also acknowledge how a learner exudes the five Polinian core values, Christ-centeredness, charism, charity, community, and commission. These values are considered as legacies equally worthy of celebration. The celebration today is not the end result, rather than an opportunity and motivation for us to reflect on our performances for this quarter and continue to develop our skills and knowledge. Not everyone may have reached the top today, but I know that they gave their best and they learned from it. To our awardee, I strongly hope that you will regard this as the beginning of your journey towards achieving your goal. We hope that each learner will be motivated by this recognition to keep up your good work in becoming a Christocentric Pauline. Congratulations, awardees, and to your parents. Thank you, and Caritas Christi Urgent Loss. Thank you, Mr. Persincola. Let us now proceed to the highlight of this event, the recognition of academic excellence and conduct awardees for the first quarter. Let us welcome the class advisors as they present to us the awardees of their section. Dear sisters, teachers, parents, and guests, I have the honor to present to you the first quarter academic and conduct awardees of Grade 1 Our Lady of the Holy Rosary. Vania C. Acosta, Academic Excellence Awardee with Honors. Bryce Anthony S. Alcancha, Academic Excellence Awardee with Honors. Marquisha Dawn P. Aliwalas, Academic Excellence Awardee with Honors. Jaida Gabriel J. Amon, Academic Excellence Awardee with Honors. Luvel Johnston P. Angeles, Academic Excellence Awardee with Honors. Johan Angela S. Aquino, Academic Excellence Awardee with Honors. Shane Caleb Q. Braulio, Academic Excellence Awardee with Honors. Danielle Moraya T. Castro, Academic Excellence with Honors and Conduct Award. Zadie Clay O. De La Torre, Academic Excellence Awardee with Honors. Jorim A. Enayon, Academic Excellence Awardee with Honors. Alia Candice R. Esquera, Academic Excellence Awardee with Honors. Tana Alexis A. Fernandez, Academic Excellence Awardee with Honors. Georgina Coralie T. Glema, Academic Excellence Awardee with Honors. Arain Yuna L. Israel, Academic Excellence Awardee with Honors. Amari Sofia 
Maria P. Malibiran, Academic Excellence Awardee with Honors. Maria Sofia E. Manabat, Academic Excellence Awardee with Honors. Luke Arlo R. Maningo, Academic Excellence with Honors and Conduct Award. Maria Amara Juliana H. Naive, Academic Excellence with Honors and Conduct Award. Amihan Jiraya V. Orbino, Academic Excellence with Honors and Conduct Award. Eros Ralph A. Pajarillo, Academic Excellence Awardee with Honors. Johan G. Kebenko, Academic Excellence Awardee with Honors. Tiffany Lauren T. Kiambao, Academic Excellence Awardee with Honors. Dana Marie D. Kilatan, Academic Excellence with Honors and Conduct Award. Ellis N. Repolio, Academic Excellence Awardee with Honors. Sachiko Yu Sakata, Academic Excellence Awardee with Honors. Jaira May H. Suarez, Academic Excellence Awardee with Honors. Sean Franco Suarez, Academic Excellence Awardee with Honors. Franco Antonio D. Tapia, Academic Excellence Awardee with Honors. Nikita Catalea G. Teofisto, Academic Excellence Awardee with Honors. Brianna L. Chusley, Academic Excellence Awardee with Honors. Congratulations Awardees and to your parents. Dear sisters, teachers, parents, and guests, I have the honor to present to you the first quarter academic and conduct awardees of Grade 1 Our Lady of Perpetual Help. Matthew Noel S. Baxa, Academic Excellence with Honors and Conduct Awardee. Emmanuel Kaya P. Castillo, Academic Excellence Awardee with Honors. Zara Beatriz D. Chan, Academic Excellence with Honors and Conduct Awardee. Sinag Lucas S. Duhay Lungsod, Academic Excellence with Honors. Johan Marie Garcia, Academic Excellence Awardee with Honors. Aniceto U. Giab III, Academic Excellence Awardee with Honors. Jacob Philip Isaac N. Bufansha, Academic Excellence with Honors and Conduct Awardee. Shin Hui T. Lau, Academic Excellence with Honors. Lara Isabel Zofia V. Matalang, Academic Excellence Awardee with Honors. Altea Gwen P. Pasha, Academic Excellence Awardee with Honors. Peyton Alexa M. Pabisevic, Academic Excellence with Honors and Conduct Awardee. Kate Niza C. Kizon, Academic Excellence Awardee with Honors. Astrid Vera G. Samute, Academic Excellence with Honors and Conduct Awardee. John Cyrus C. Santos, Academic Excellence with Honors and Conduct Awardee. 
Alexis Lovisa Tayao, Academic Excellence Awardee with Honors. Fumika V. Tokayrin, Academic Excellence Awardee with Honors. Sebastian Angelo S. Villarina, Academic Excellence Awardee with Honors. Congratulations, Awardees Parents! Dear sisters, teachers, parents, and guests, I have the honor to present to you the first quarter academic and conduct awardees of Grade 2 St. Lorenzo Ruiz. Ace Francis G. Alba, Academic Excellence with Honors and Conduct Awardee. John Rafael S. Aquino, Academic Excellence Awardee. Asher Haley Imrich D. Belen, Academic Excellence with Honors and Conduct Awardee. Zia Martina Obermundo, Academic Excellence with Honors and Conduct Awardee. Leigh Raister G. Gutierrez, Academic Excellence with Honors and Conduct Awardee. Hera A. Kim, Conduct Awardee Adele Maria B. Pangan Academic Excellence with Honors and Conduct Awardee Hannah Rafael C. Pascasio Academic Excellence Awardee with Honors Ezekiel A. Reyes Academic Excellence with Honors and Conduct Awardee Maria Alexandra U. San Luis, Academic Excellence with Honors and Conduct Awardee. Enzo Luis M. Segui, Academic Excellence with Honors and Conduct Awardee. Elizabeth Irene Velasco, Academic Excellence with Honors and Conduct Awardee. Congratulations, awardees, and to your parents. Dear sisters, teachers, parents, and guests, I have the honor to present to you the first quarter academic and conduct awardees of Grade 2 St. Peter. Jasmine Ayla A. Antioho, Academic Excellence with Honors and Conduct Award. William Ellie R. Baniket, Academic Excellence Awardee with Honors. Orla Athena D. Castillo, Academic Excellence with Honors and Conduct Awardee. Gianna Ezra F. Conducta, Academic Excellence with Honors and Conduct Awardee. Zaki Gabriel R. Desti, Academic Excellence with Honors and Conduct Award. Dominic Avin L. Duque, Academic Excellence Awardee with Honors. Sean Matthew C. Fantastico, Academic Excellence with Honors and Conduct Award. Bentley Margo Winnet B. Inama, Academic Excellence Awardee with Honors. John Jacob D. Howe, Academic Excellence Awardee with Honors. Liam Jared D. Maralag, Academic Excellence Awardee with Honors. Erica A. Motoyoshi, Academic Excellence with Honors and Conduct Award. Kaylee Cayenne O. Naganyo, Academic Excellence with Honors. Juliana Kathleen G. Netro, Academic Excellence with Honors and Conduct Award. Jaden Hermimaya D. Kitolio, 
academic excellence with honors. Ara A. Reformina, academic excellence awardee with honors. Cassandra Naili Rindon, academic excellence with honors and conduct award. Wancho Kiefer A. Silang, Academic Excellence Awardee with Honors. Yuki A. Yoshoka, Academic Excellence Awardee with Honors. Congratulations, awardees, and to your parents. Dear sisters, teachers, parents, and guests, I have the honor to present to you the first quarter academic and conduct awardees of Grade 3 St. Anne. Katrin Audrey Abordo, Academic Excellence with Honors and Conduct Awardee. Dominic Justin Alcobert, Conduct Awardee. Celeste Carmen Anulacion, Academic Excellence with Honors and Conduct Awardee. Nicole Shine Bartolo, Academic Excellence with Honors. Avishon Benosa, Academic Excellence Awardee with Honors. Jace Roland Bulatao, Academic Excellence Awardee with Honors. Sia Venice Isabel Calara, Academic Excellence with Honors and Conduct Awardee. Gail Maxine De Asa, Academic Excellence Awardee with Honors. Riley Ann Denoga, Academic Excellence Awardee with Honors. Alessandra Therese Diaz, Academic Excellence with Honors and Conduct Awardee. Hil Mateo Diaz, Academic Excellence Awardee with Honors. Isa Maria Dimaculangan, Academic Excellence Awardee with Honors. Lex Adniel Flores, Academic Excellence Awardee with Honors. Natalie Shine B. Gregorio, Academic Excellence Awardee with Honors. Errol Guna, Academic Excellence Awardee with Honors. Marcus Caleb Inanuran, Academic Excellence with Honors and Conduct Awardee. Audie Margaret Inama, Academic Excellence Awardee with Honors. Lexi May Gunatas, Academic Excellence Awardee with Honors. Juana Andrea Manzano, Academic Excellence with Honors and Conduct Awardee. Luis Ivan Zakari Matala, Academic Excellence with Honors and Conduct Awardee. Rajin Picanya, Academic Excellence Awardee with Honors. Mary Yasmin B. Samson, Academic Excellence Awardee with Honors. Riley Vasquez, Academic Excellence Awardee with Honors. Jacob Kent Burr, Academic Excellence with Honors and Conduct Awardee. Lucia Feliz Verdejo, Academic Excellence with Honors and Conduct Awardee. Benice Riella Vicencio, Academic Excellence with Honors and Conduct Awardee. Samantha Angelique Villarina, Academic Excellence with Honors and Conduct Awardee. Congratulations Awardees and to your parents. Dear sisters, teachers, parents, and guests, I have the honor to present to you the first quarter academic and conduct awardees of Grade 3 St. Elizabeth.
Kylie Claire E. Bison, Academic Excellence with Honors, and Conduct Awardee. Ace York Gideon V. Cantuba, Academic Excellence Awardee with Honors. Jamie L. Christian B. Chuwakiko, Academic Excellence Awardee with Honors. Kit Micaela C. Pamero, Academic Excellence with Honors and Conduct Awardee. Julian Marie Isabel N. Lupancha, Academic Excellence Awardee with Honors. Joshman Kevin E. Manabat, Academic Excellence Awardee with Honors. Jamira Andrea U. Manzanero, Academic Excellence Awardee with Honors. Justin Ray I. Poot, Academic Excellence with Honors and Conduct Awardees. Sebastian Lucas C. Sagarbaria, Academic Excellence with Honors and Conduct Awardees. Congratulations, Awardees, and to your parents. Dear sisters, teachers, parents, and guests, I have the honor to present to you the first quarter academic and conduct awardee of Grade 4 St. Agnes. Nina Balikan, Academic Excellence Awardee with Honors. John Andre R. Boutro, Academic Excellence with Honor and Conduct Award. Avery Gail G. Borja, Academic Excellence with Honors and Conduct Award. Keith Harvin A. Cambalia, Academic Excellence with Honors and Conduct Award. Chastity Prissy Joy D. Simanes, Academic Excellence with Honors and Conduct Award. KZL Joshua G. Herman, Academic Excellence with Honors and Conduct Award. Simon Wench P. Gutierrez, Academic Excellence with Honors and Conduct Award. Selena Angela B. Ignacio, Academic Excellence with Honors and Conduct Award. Solara Kayen Napigit, Academic Excellence with Honors and Conduct Award. Elisha Jenny G. Pascual, Academic Excellence with Honors and Conduct Award. Melvinson Jacob M. Santos, Academic Excellence with Honors and Conduct Award. Maria Carabina Deus H. Juarez, Academic Excellence with Honors and Conduct Award. Congratulations, awardees and to your parents. Dear sisters, teachers, parents, and guests, I have the honor to present to you the first quarter academic and conduct awardees of grade 4 centuries of the child Jesus. Pia Emmanuel B. Aguilar, Academic Excellence with Honors and Conduct Awardee. Jasmine L. Artes, Conduct Awardee. Daphne Moira T. Castro, Conduct Awardee. Jana Irene T. Cruz, Academic Excellence with Honors and Conduct Awardee. Maeve Kate McDonnell, Conduct Awardee. Maria Lily T. Gambol, Conduct Awardee. Gabriel Luis Angelo D. Luzano, Academic Excellence with Honors and Conduct Awardee. Cyrus Ivan F. Medina, Conduct Awardee. Viana Lendi A. Morelos, Academic Excellence with Honors and Conduct Awardee. Calvin Caden O. Nagano, Academic Excellence with Honors and Conduct Awardee. Anya Marie Sophia D. Panti, Academic Excellence with Honors 
and Conduct Awardee, Julian Kaelin Pan, Academic Excellence with Honors and Conduct Awardee, Adriel Jacob L. Pienzo, Academic Excellence with Honors and Conduct Awardee, Jonathan Yale R. Vicente, Academic Excellence and Conduct Awardee. Congratulations, awardees, and to your parents. Dear sisters, teachers, parents, and guests, I have the honor to present to you the first quarter academic and conduct awardees of Grade 5 St. Mark. Aldrich Kirby O. Kamp, Academic Excellence with Honors and Conduct Awardee. Jody Seven M. De La Cruz, Academic Excellence with Honors and Conduct Awardee. Nino H. Lorente, Academic Excellence with Honors and Conduct Awardee. Winette Julia D. Maliare, Conduct Awardee. Gavin Maurice Maniego, Academic Excellence Awardee with Honors. Ira Carly A. Pajarillo, Academic Excellence with Honors and Conduct Awardee. Tiza Naomi A. Perelio, Conduct Awardee. Charles Aspen B. Rivera, Conduct Awardee. Congratulations, awardees, and to your parents. Dear sisters, teachers, parents, and guests, I have the honor to present to you the first quarter academic and conduct awardees of Grade 5 St. Timothy. Francesca Isabel L. Aguilar, Academic Excellence with Honors and Conduct Award. Mackenzie B. Brandstater, Academic Excellence with Honors and Conduct Award. Sophia Clarice M. Bunli, Academic Excellence Award with Honors. Ramona Paula G. Casas, Academic Excellence with Honors and Conduct Award. Isbel Amor P. Castillo, Conduct Award. Damian Rafael O. Galliarte, Academic Excellence with Honors and Conduct Award. Aisha Mikaela C. Herlihy, Academic Excellence with Honors and Conduct Award. Antonella Janina Ong, Academic Excellence Award with Honors. Aaron Sebastian D. Roselada, Academic Excellence with Honors and Conduct Award. Eliana Teres Joy P. Untalan, Academic Excellence with Honors and Conduct Award. Congratulations, awardees, and to your parents. Thank you, advisors, and congratulations to all awardees. Let us now witness selected students from grade 8 for an intermission number to be followed by a video presentation of the thematic activities from August to October. Oh. 
for your amazing performance, students. At this juncture, let us lend our ears and open our hearts to an inspirational message to be given to us by our vibrant and hardworking academic services head, Mr. Raymond Andre Samonte. Dear sisters, colleagues, teachers, parents, and most especially, our beloved students. Good day and peace be with you. First, let me congratulate everyone for a job well done during the first quarter. This event truly reminds us that excellence is the culture and character is our soul as the Polinian community. As we celebrate today's excellence, may we be reminded of our uniqueness and diversity. Each of us has his or her own abilities and potentials waiting to be unleashed at the proper day, time, and moment. Remembering our abilities and potentials, I am reminded of a story about the sad peacock. Allow me to spare a little time in this fable. A stunning peacock with glittering feathers was dancing on a rainy day. As the rain was so pleasant, he was dancing with happiness and started singing. But as he tried singing, his rough voice reminded him that he does not have a good voice when singing. So all the joy of the rain got beaten out of him as he dwelled on his floor. While the peacock was drowning in discontent in his ability to sing, a nightingale started singing with joy while enjoying the rain on a hot summer day. When the melodious voice of the nightingale is heard by the peacock, it further reminded him about his flaw. He began wondering why he was cursed to have such a horrible voice while the nightingale had such an appealing voice. A forest fairy then appeared and noticed the peacock sobbing. It was baffling to the fairy that the peacock who loved dancing in the rain was in despair. Why are you upset in such beautiful weather? The fairy asked the peacock. The peacock complained about his hoarse voice and how unfortunate he couldn't sing like a nightingale. Why does the nightingale have a melodious voice? But I don't. It is unfair that I cannot sing in this beautiful weather. The forest fairy listened to the sad peacock and calmly answered, Everyone is special in their own way. Everyone is born with unique traits and characteristics that help them shine their way. Yes, the nightingale is blessed with a melodious voice, but you are also blessed with your unique dancing talent. You can dance gracefully, flaunting your beautiful glittering feathers. So please, do not compare yourself with others. See what you have and make the best out of it. You'll never be happy with yourself if you constantly compare yourself with others. The peacock realized how silly he has been in comparing himself to others and forgetting his blessings. He realized that everyone was unique in some way or another. The story about the peacock reminds us that self-acceptance is the first step to happiness. We always have a choice to be happy and make the best of what we can do at a certain moment. The moment without accepting ourselves is the moment we start not giving our best selves to others. Use your God-given gifts in academics and deportment to help others. 
Aside from accepting ourselves, we must also learn to accept others. There will always be people greater and lesser than us. Some would even compliment on the things we lack, while some adds to the things that we excel on. Regardless of the things you or they lack, we all have but to accept. Because being a true Polinian means being all to all, accepting all of all, and loving all in all. As we journey together in the middle of the pandemic, may we work as one Polinian community, hand in hand, using our own abilities and gifts to accept one another, help one another, serve one another, and loving one another. Because at the end of the day, the heart and soul of Polinian education is the Polinian community itself. Thank you very much for spending your time with us in this convocation. Congratulations once again to the awardees and parents, Caritas Christi Orjetnos. Thank you very much, Sir Sam. Journalist and author Germany Kent once wrote, Gratitude is one of the most powerful human emotions. Once expressed, it changes attitude, brightens outlook, and broadens our perspective. This is a day of thanksgiving for a quarter that has passed and for all the fruits of everyone's labor paying off. To deliver a message of gratitude on behalf of this quarter's awardees, we would like to call on Gabriel Julia M. De Luna, Grade 8 St. Agatha Awardee. To our dear school directress principal, Sister Mirna Costante, SPC, SPC sisters, school administrators, faculty and staff, teachers, parents, families, and my dear fellow Polinians, an amazing afternoon to all of you and peace be with you. First of all, I would like to congratulate the awardees for the first quarter of this school year. Congratulations to everyone for a job well done. But as we gather here virtually today to be acknowledged for the accomplishments we have achieved, let's just pause and try to ask ourselves, was I really that good? Was I really able to reach this on my own? I am certain that all of us will share the same answer, and that is no. Yes, we really have done a great job. There's no doubt about that. But it would be impossible for us to succeed if not for the people in our lives. So, as we celebrate today, may we remember to give thanks to those who have led us to this moment. Forever on the top of our list, to our generous and loving God, we would like to express our profound gratitude to you. Thank you, Father God, for making all the means we need available for us to continue with our learning, despite any situation we may be in. For the knowledge, strength, and will that you are unceasingly bestowing upon us, for always looking after us. Thank you. Since this pandemic, the models of learning and the different platforms we have been using all contributed to the adaptable and resilient Polinians that we have become at present. You allowed us to be limited so that we can realize that no limitations can end our hopes and dreams. So now we offer back to you all that we have accomplished and achieved. Thank you, Father God, for your immense love for us. We would also like to say our heartfelt gratitude to our dearly loved parents and guardians. Thank you for your commitment to sacrifice a huge lot so that you can give us our needs and even our wants. Thank you for having our backs every time we need support. You are our real-life superheroes. We also thank you for being a role model to us, for inspiring us, for trusting us, believing in us and also for listening to us. We offer our deepest gratitude to you, our dearest parents, for your untiring support and for your great love for us. We love you more than words can say. 
to our beloved advisors and subject teachers, thank you so much to each and every one of you. Please know that we appreciate you for all your hard work in making sure we learn whether we are online or at school. Most of all, thank you for your patience and understanding, for not getting tired in encouraging us to finish and submit our task and to do better and to be better. Thank you. We will always be grateful to you, our dear teachers, for the loving care and guidance you are giving us. To our dear sisters led by our school directress principal, Sister Mirna Castante, SPC, school administrators, faculty, and staff, our big thanks to all of you for your joint effort in making it possible for us to continue learning while ensuring our safety, including that of our family members. You have all worked so hard in planning and implementing the HEAL program to make certain that neither our education nor our health needs to be compromised. Your concern and protection for the well-being of the Polinians, both online and hybrid, mean a lot to us. Our sincerest thanks to you. Lastly, to our friends and classmates. Most of us have been here since kinder, so we are practically like brothers and sisters who have experienced similar challenges. So let us not forget to thank our friends and classmates for being there for us, for cheering us on, and for comforting us when we need someone to talk to. Always remember that when you feel like giving up, we are all part of a big family ready to give our love and support. Thank you to all of you guys for bringing more fun into our classes and for a great start to this school year. As I end these words of thanks, let me share with you once more my favorite verse from the letter of St. Paul from Philippians chapter 4, verse 13. I can do all things through Christ who strengthens me. Once again, on behalf of my fellow Polinians, I would like to thank you and may God bless us all. Caritas Christi Urgent Nos. Thank you, DJ, for your message. As this program is about to conclude, we would like to call Mr. Kian Evangelista, advisor of Grade 8 St. Genevieve, for the closing remarks. Sister Mirna Castante, SPC, sisters, teachers, parents, and to our young Polinians, good day and peace be with you. We are glad that we are once again able to gather, although virtually, to celebrate the successes of our achievers through this convocation. I would like to extend my warmest congratulations to the awardees. You deserve this celebration. Indeed, being recognized and awarded for your hard work brings joy and pride. It is a mark of your perseverance in academics. It is a symbol of your character in school. Dear parents, guardians, and fellow educators, these children look to us for strength and inspiration. Let us be worthy of their emulation despite the setbacks. And we also look to God for guidance in this noble duty to hone future nation builders. Before I end, I would like to give a challenge to our awardees. Always remember that being recognized comes with responsibility. As the awardees, you are the exemplary students. You are the role models of your classmates and schoolmates. You are the representation of excellence of St. Paul College of Makati. I hope that you continue to strive harder and showcase that Polinians are academically competent and morally upright. Once again, congratulations awardees and Caritas Christi Urget Nos. Thank you, Mr. Evangelista. Before this program ends, we would like to thank the people who made this event possible. Sister Mirna Castante SPC, Mr. Raymond Andre Samonte, the middle managers, grade level advisors, teachers, staff and personnel, and most especially to our dear students and parents.
we would like to request everyone to take time to answer the evaluation for this day's event. You may access the link through the QR code flashed on the screen. To formally close this event, may I call on Jamila Moira Concepcion, Grade 8 awardee for our closing prayer, to be followed by the singing of the Polinian Mission Song. Let us be aware of Christ's presence in our hearts and adore His holy name. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Dear Heavenly Father, it is a wonderful privilege to come before you with thanksgiving in our hearts. In the name of Jesus Christ, we want to thank you for how far you have led us. Thank you for letting us hold this wonderful event today. Thank you to each one of us who have worked hard to receive merit awards today. We thank you for all the blessings we have received, and we pray that you continue to bless us beyond our wildest dreams. As we conclude this event, we pray that you will always be with us in our hearts and minds. Thank you for hearing and responding to our prayer. In Jesus' name, in which we pray and believe, amen. Mary, our mother and model, pray for us. St. Paul, our patron, pray for us. Father Richaud and the First Sister, intercede for us. May the love of Christ impel us, now and forever, amen. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, amen. This ends today's program. Please be reminded that the viewing of grades will be on Monday, November 21, 2022. Again, I would like to congratulate all the students who were recognized in this quarter's convocation as well as the parents and family members who witnessed this program. May God bless us all. Caritas Christi Urgent Nos.